what a wonderful place we are thinking right now. And you're absolutely right, this is Gorkovo Park, Gorky Park. Uh, we have a, a big famous Russian band with the name of Gorky Park, Moscow Calling. We have heard this song a lot of times, I think. So this is the Gorky Park. And uh, the Gorky Park band is not the only one inspired by this place. Wait till the end of the show, I'll give you the interesting info. So many different places here. Playground, food courts, restaurants, swimming, sunbathing, everything. Sports activities. And that's the map. Well, this is a Gorky Park. It had been uh, established in 1999 and it was the central park of rest and culture. <laughs> rest and culture. Yeah, sounds stupid, but it was the name of it. From that period of time, every like 10 years, something reopening here, changing. And now it's uh, the name uh, Park Gorkova, Gorky Park. And I think this is the best park in Moscow. Uh, you can pump some water in here and your kids will make a dams by their own, like redirecting uh, the river and the waters here. And all, everything here is working. No, hello, like on a factory, uh, windmill, whatever. A very interesting place for a kid to, you know, get closer to uh, physics, mechanics, and work a little bit with your hands and with your brains take away the kids joy yeah you can see Punk is uh, amazed uh, there is this uh, river play playground and this one is also a new one I mean uh, I've been here last summer then I go to Asia for a year I've been living in Bali as you know and I do not know I've never seen this place before in here in Park in Gorky Park so as not the first time thank you for making me uh, walking outside to make a videos for you and that's why I get a lot of wonderful emotions for myself and here I think we gotta try a little bit of riding and here there are different type of swings a family one over there I can see there's a couple so and a kids one for the kids for the grown-ups and for yeah completely small children. I think there is a green or red and uh, blue lights, so we gotta came back here by the night time. Maybe it will make more common sense. And another playground, come on, can you please? Why are they gonna stop? Everything is so new for me, I'm impressed. So there's many expositions coming up right here in this building, I've been here once. Uh, there was a, the anime painter, so a guy with a Japanese culture and now there is something else represented on the street and there is a, another exposition over there in a white building and something right here in the garage. There is a modern art and contemporary art, most of all, so, uh, and uh, people like, you know, who is still alive is coming here and taking the exhibitions, works, music, pictures, anything, everything they are doing. The rush is a good place. Now there is a giant ball. Do you know, understand the meaning of this ball? Step inside and... I'll be honest with you, Gorky Park is the first park I've ever taken a night in. I mean, I've taken a blanket, my favorite one, and easily just lay down somewhere around. And uh, it was a summer period, very hot, and uh, people is hanging out in the park till the early morning, so 24 hours. Uh, somebody is uh, leaving, somebody just coming here. Uh, and there is a Nike box MSK, something with a sport connection. That's not my theme now. <laughs> just kidding. Oh, and there is a fountain. That's too far and I'm too lazy, as I would say. Sport is not my type. There is a yoga and there is a photos. Uh, I'll give you a zoom a little bit. So there is a football field. Let me see if it's, if it's free to go or you should pay or just ask somebody to open it for you. There is a lot. 
Oh my God, there is such a big lock. Now it's free to use. So if you like football, you just can come over and play the field, use it. And it's quite good, wonderful. Uh, now I'll know where I'm going to play football with my friends. This park even better, even better than I thought, you know. I've came here to show you around how good it is to be here and now I'm expressed myself. Wow, how good it is to be here. This is the biggest pond in Durki Park. Here you can fishing, not fishing, driving a little boat, which are not here right now because of the COVID, or you can take a pizza in this place, which is now closed because of the COVID. But all the other period of times, you can fishing, eating, swimming, sunbathing, right here with no problem in Durki Park. And there's, I can show you uh, boats available for you those uh, double no four person at the same time uh, you can rent it catamaran how to say catamaran in english language catamaran at the end of the bridge you can see uh moscow city towers and the ministry of defense and the gorky park and we're going back because we've moved on the one side and now we got on an embankment. And I have a wonderful story about the inspiration by the Gorky Park, the, one of the greatest songs in a human history. There was a technical works on an embankment and we've seen a sign, the Rosari on the right. From the bridge, you're getting down, you can see Ponka right here and, oh, there is a, a beach cafe, but we don't go there. Oh, maybe we will, I don't know. And there is a Rosario with another beautiful fountain. Oh, Gorky Park. You make me go crazy about you. You are so wonderful. Moskva, down the Gorky Park, uh, listening to the wind of change. That song by the Scorpions made in 1990 was, uh, I think, the greatest hit of uh, the end of 20th century. Still one of the most favorite songs. And this whispering in, in the beginning. You know, I'm not a good singer, but this guy, Klaus Meine, from the Scorpions in uh, August 11, 1989, was uh, driving a boat here on the Moskva River, on this direction. And uh, when they was across the Gorky Park right here, they make a stop over there, get on, land, they get landed, and uh, moved into a hard rock cafe a barbecue and the Klaus take a look around and realize that there is a modern music playing different people spending time together different cultural different races and at the moment he realized that the Soviet Union is no longer existing everything is moving on uh, and the music is the thing that makes everybody come together and that's how the song winds of change being created in the end so right here I follow the Moskva down the Gorky Park. This place inspired Scorpion's band, Klaus Meine, for the, one of the greatest songs of a human history. Oh, and now we are going to the sports center. And this Niskuch Nisad is, I will try to translate it. Sad is like a garden and Niskuchne it's uh, when you're not bored. So, not boring garden. 
and it's this direction. We won't go there, it's up to you. Uh, let it be a surprise. And uh, Neskuch Nisad is also one of the park, uh, like pieces of the Zgorky Park complex. And so there is Muzion. Our next show will be about Muzion. Our previous was about Muzion, I don't know. Uh, so Muzion, Gorky Park and Neskuch Nisad. All this is Gorky Park complex. Uh, and Gorky Park and Muzion we will represent to you and Neskuch Nisad it will be a dessert for the strongest, for the bravest, for the life lovers. I mean, I'm talking about you. So when you come here, you'll take a look by yourself. No spoilers. So uh, press the heart button, follow our channel, ask something in commentary, just make some activities going on. And thank you for being with us. Your friend Sergei Dubrov is best free guide in the world. Oh my God, hot dogs. And this is the food court territory. There is a uh, sleeping bags, a big uh, landscape, lawn. So you can take a bag, take some kind of food and get killing your hunger within a second. And there's different type of foods, all the styled, European for youngsters. Uh, I'm not hungry, so I just won't go inside. Uh, average check here will be about five, six dollars. So for a hamburger, for example, a pizza, it will be six, seven, sometimes eight dollars. So you can afford it, no worries. And you can chill also right in here. But we are going to a sport event because after eating, you get a lot of fat in your body. So you got to, you know, work it out to be fit like me or my punka. This is the main gate to the Gorky Park. Big and beautiful. And there's a central alley. And now it's also under a little bit of reconstruction. But in front of us, there is a wonderful fountain that have ability to sing and to change colors. But it's only on episodes. You can see the schedule in the internet, gorkypark.com or in Instagram or millions of other resources that provide information about the main activities and objects in Moscow, in Russia or anywhere else in the world. The end of Central Alley. A big concert is happening sometimes right here. After the fountain, the stage is quite high. So you can see it from here. And now they started to make a skating ring. So they're performing, they're starting to make it from here and then it goes further and deeper in the park. And as you can see, all the fans right here. And so no people are inside of this fence area. All of this will become a skating ring. It will be huge. Oh, not the truck I wanted to show you wonderful it's time for us to get out so we're heading to the exit or to the entrance it's up to you oh press the hard button follow our channel help us out support us stay with us be with us love us and go to russia my friends go to amazing mother russia it's 5 p.m now and we are in moscow and if you came up with a question where to go and what to do, I have a wonderful answer. Go to Gorky Park and get inspirational energy and positive emotions. Please go to Russia, go to those wonderful parks. Gorky Park is located in the center of Moscow, nearby the Kremlin. So you can just take a walk there from the, from the Kremlin, from the Red Square in 20 minutes. Uh, or you can take a metro, it's Oktyabrskaya or Park Kulturi. It's a circle line, the brown one, uh, or a cab. But I prefer my feet, the best transport. <laughs> 